Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I'm Maddie, if you're new here, welcome. Today I'm just gonna go over my minimal desk setup. I'm living at my boyfriend's parents, so I'm basically living in his, mom, his mom's office, so. Um, so this chair is just from Amazon. It's nothing special. This is my MacBook. I just bought a white case and then got the skin on Etsy. Um, I use this planner stand for my planner. I actually have two of them. I'll show a picture of both of them. Um, I like them for different reasons. And then going into these drawers, I just have like my everyday tools pretty much. I always like to have a calculator because I don't like to grab my phone. Um, I just have these business cards ready to go. Just some random stuff that I need to find a place for. <laughs> um, just some lotion. We got some pens from one of the stationery boxes. This calculator so I just like to keep it right there and then some pens that I like to use and then all of my um, currently used sticky notes so. moving on to this cart I got this cart at Amazon um, I really really like it so far it was gonna be a planner cart but I just kind of use it as like a side table um, so I have my coffee over there and I keep my highlighters and then I keep this like stand up acrylic sign and I always stick sticky notes on it to kind of remind me and then it has like a little spot where I put chargers um, this is a like a little mug warming thing but obviously I have the thermos right now um, down here we got some blocks I just have some more scissors just easy to grab stuff I just like to keep it at the side of my desk or on the side of me um, and then at the very bottom, I just have some more stuff I'm going to probably use when I get, when we purchase a house. This is, I just found this at Walmart. This is another cute little organizer for like, um, sticky notes. Moving on over here, we just have a bunch of inserts that I use all the time. I'm just going to go through everything with you guys. So I have this like wrought iron acrylic thing. I don't even know what you call it, but it basically I stick notepads on it or like written ones just so I can like look at notes real quick. And then I have this acrylic drawer and this is this has all my 2021 stuff so far. Stay tuned for that video. Um, but yeah, I think I'm just going to keep like main inserts that I'm using in here. But yeah, um, I just think that's really cute. And then I found this brochure organizer. It is perfect for 85 size inserts. I'm obsessed with it. It is just so cute. And I just like to see all of my inserts at once. Um, sometimes I file them away, but this is like my favorite way to do it just because they're like on display and they're cute and pretty. And then I just have this acrylic tray, which I was going to use for like an inbox outbox, but I don't know what I'm going to do with it now because I kind of broke it. But yeah, I just have like business cards. Um, I just have like some random, random stuff in here. So this is whatever. And then this cubic shelf, I just have everything that I need like at, like to grab right away. It's like to the right of me. So nothing's too far. This is, um, these are just all my planners. I'm gonna sell some of these. Um, I'm gonna do a collection video soon, but yeah, this is just like basically my planner bin. It's acrylic, of course. And then down here, I just have like a bunch of like stuff to organize my inserts. Um, like, I forget what it's called, but it's like that plastic stuff. And then I just have more planners. Here's all my cloth and paper pens. I've got pens and then I have like all of um, pens I haven't tried yet. Uh, you can't even see the label on there. Oh, these are sub, uh, subscription box pens. And then we have all of my like main, th these are the pens I use all the time. So I like to keep this stocked up. And then I just keep um, 
these right here so in case I want to like do a pen test or highlighter test and then these are all of my highlighters which I plan on doing a hi highlighter video so stay tuned <laughs> okay so all these gold notebooks are my archiving system so I have my 2021 set up somewhere in here um, yeah so I have like two binders full of that and then I just love it because they are like literally 35 millimeter rings they are beautiful down here we just have my um, extra sticky notes don't judge me I have a lot of sticky notes but I do give a lot away to like friends and family just as like Christmas or birthday presents or if I'm making them a planner um, but I do I have a problem with sticky notes I just I feel like I'm gonna run out or something <laughs> Uh, this is uh, just an acrylic file organizer. I think I'm gonna keep like main, like quick stuff that I need to file away because a lot of stuff I'm gonna just um, scan and throw away. But this is my sticker organizer. So this actually is perfect for A6 inserts, this little container. I love it though for A6 inserts. And then this is for like memory planning. It's just like ugly stickers that I, I, I can't throw anything away. I'm such a hoarder. Um, and then this is all my like functional stickers and I keep receipts in here, um, receipts in the back and then like some like organize, like some uh, plastic envelopes. And then, yeah, I just have a way too many stickers, but I, it makes me so happy. I want to, I want to organize them in a different way when I actually have an office. Um, where I can see everything, but for now I like that these are all safe. Um, I have all like my icons in the front. Um, I don't really have a organ. I just kind of like lump them together, but I just love it. I just like that they're all safe in here. And then <clears throat> this is basically just like box planner boxes. I'm selling everything, so um, I'm gonna need these. And then oh, this is. A personal size binder of the same kind. I just think they're so pretty. And then down here, these are all my washi tape, or I'm sorry, um, stickers, but washi tape uh, dispensers. Um, just some more stuff, just so much stuff. But I'm, I plan on using this more functionally when I move it to a house. And then this thing I got on Amazon, my boyfriend put it together. He said it was pretty easy though. Um, but yeah, on the top, I just basically keep like planner stuff that I use. And then this little tray, I archive like quick inserts that I'm not going to use. So anything that like I just need to file away eventually, I'll just stick in here. And then I'll um, I'll do it all at once. So, like I have old like um, task cards or old uh, journaling cards from previous months. Um, I don't like to, to throw anything away. Just if I want to look back, um, that's another hoarding secret of mine. <laughs> but it's such a cute little acrylic tray too. I just love it. I just love it. And then this thing I got from Walmart, it was like 15 bucks or 10 bucks. And this is where I keep all of like my main pens that I use, like pens that I like want to try or I don't know. It's just kind of like other planner stuff like on the go too. So I just keep all of my little tools in here. Okay, this first drawer is just some sticky notes. Basically, main stuff that I use, again, um, I don't know if I need all of this space, but for right now, um, these are just like random tools that I use, like sometimes I need a level, so this is perfect. <laughs> Screwdriver. Uh, my earring. So yeah, basically just little things that I need to remember. Oh yeah, like I have this for um, my little memo board. <laughs> the next drawer, 
So this one has journaling cards, some more planner tools, and then this little book with all my my eye clips, just everything. Journaling cards, journaling cards, and then some more pens, and then like, yeah, white out and whatnot. You never know. And then a bunch of bookmarks, yes. This next one, this is my second favorite drawer. <laughs> I love how I set it up. So all these acrylic trays are from Walmart, or I'm sorry, Amazon. You could probably find them at Walmart too though. Um, but yeah, I have all my circle sticky notes at the front here. Um, I just have them on the side as well. And then they're just kind of all over the place. Um, <clears throat> but I love that drawer. Okay, this is my favorite drawer. Oh, page flags. I am obsessed with page flags and I know I am and I don't care. So whatever. <laughs> but yeah, I just love, I just, it makes me happy. I love it. And I use them. I make page flags for projects and all kinds of stuff like that I'm constantly doing or just like a one-time project. So I always go through them pretty quickly and I have some ready to go. These are all like blanks that I'm going to make my system, my 2021 system. So they're all just here ready to go. And then I have this little thing I shared on Instagram already. Um, a lot of people liked it. Um, it's two-sided, but I couldn't find on Amazon. I, um, I'm going to try to find something to link, but these are Walmart in the craft section. That's how I found them. I know it's the perfect size for these mini page flags and square sticky notes or page flags, square page flags. <laughs> And then in here we just have a bunch of notepads. Um, these are like my nice notepads. I have another stash where my boyfriend grabs our other notepads, but um, I do use these on, the, on a daily basis. Now this is all my electronic stuff. This is stuff that I come in to quite often. I, I come visit quite often. Um, so I have like all of my um, like zip drives or zip drives. Um, yeah. And then I use these little containers to organize all of the cords just because they get so like tangled. <laughs> so yeah, it has like camera chargers, um, like a little remote for turning or like starting my camera. So, and then this last drawer, I just have a bunch of like planner stuff again. <laughs> and then this is my brand new coffin paper. Um, I forget what it's called. But it's like the contoured leather, I think. And then some magazines that I like to hold on to because I'm featured in them. And then, yeah, that is my desk setup. It's definitely much smaller than I'm used to. So I'm kind of proud of myself with how I organized it. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, leave them down below. But I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.